Today, I just want to give you an update on what I really think of QuickPage after using it for a week, a week and a half. Hey guys, <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. Well, the masses have spoken, well, all two or three of you. Um, I'm killing the music. That's it. The music is over. So do not worry. You're not going to hear any music on this video. So after a week and a half of Quick Page, um, I have to say I still love it. I have a review up here that you can actually um, access and see the, the full initial review. In this follow up video, I just want to show you how I use Quick Page. So what I've been using it for is when somebody books a call with me and I get a notification that they booked a call with me, I automatically send them out a um, email with the nice video page. So let me just go into quick page here and uh, let me show you what I do. So I get an email and uh, I see that somebody has booked a call with me. So what I do is I'll just open up my um, laptop because it doesn't really work so well to do what I'm going to do. Uh, on mobile, but I would open up my laptop and what I will do is I will duplicate this video page for them. So let's just have a look at this video page here. So it says it's really quick. You must watch this. It's a video and there's a nice little GIF and it says, wait, 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 don't do anything yet. Now, what's my process? Well, somebody comes in, I just go here and I go to duplicate page and I just duplicate that page and I have it here and then I customize it. So I might say, hey, really quick, uh, John. Okay, must watch. And I change the name that's here and I put in John and then I share that. So that's really, really simple to do. And then when I've had the call, I will send them this video here and it says it's a few days since our call. And then afterwards, what I will do is after maybe a week, I will send them this one, which is, hey, did you miss the video that I sent you? So all I'm doing is I created one video I then created the page that I want to send them to and the email that I want to send to them. And each time I just duplicate this page. So super, super simple. Now, you might be thinking, well, if you're doing, you know, five or six calls a day, your dashboard here is going to get very cluttered. Well, what you can actually do is, and uh, I just found this out, is you can actually archive the uh, page. So what Archive does is it hides the page from your actual dashboard here, but the page is still active and the person, if they come back to it in a week, can still see that particular page. So what I can do here is I can just go sort and I can say, well, show me all archive pages. I can go back to sort and say, show me all temp, show me all templated pages, or I could show all pages. Now you'll see that if I were to show all pages, um, it's showing me all active pages, not the actual archived ones. Or I could search here as well. Uh, what else is useful here? Well, you can actually just always go in and change the settings here of this page. You can disable the chat, disable page notifications, unpublish the page, disable it from sharing, etc. We saw all of these in the actual previous previous video. And this is what you can do with the chat as well. You can add in an opt-in message, custom content at the top, at the bottom, and of course, a tracking code if you wish. Now, all messages that you have received are displayed here. Okay, you can see um, all of the messages here. Uh, contacts, if you want to add your contacts, I don't actually do it. This is Chad himself from Quick Pages. If you had a team, you could add the team in and you have your library there. Now, what can I say after seven to 10 days of use of this? Well, it's absolutely fantastic, I have to say. It's so easy to use. The support is super, super, super responsive and they're really, really nice and knowledgeable. Um, they have fixed that issue that was coming up with the iPhone 12 that it wouldn't, uh, it wouldn't transcode the video properly. So this to me is absolutely perfect. It's, it's something you need in your toolkit if you are trying to engage customers, if you want to be more personal, more contactable to customers. Uh, for me, yeah, just, just get this. There is, of course, um, a link in the description, as always. And of course, um, if you have any questions, do let me know. If you'd like to hear the music come back, just let me know, <laughs> which I'm sure you don't. 
And listen, guys, thank you so much for your feedback because your feedback helps me get better and produce better videos for you. Talk to you very soon. Bye.